Well, I got into fishing as a very young boy. Um, my dad took me on fishing holidays from the age of three. So, uh, yeah, it's been a kind of an indoctrination that I couldn't get away from, but uh, it got to be a real passion. And I soon realized just how much I love fishing. I got fairly good at it at a pretty young age and uh, just continued from there. And when I realized that I could actually make a living from doing something I loved, I guess I might be one of the luckiest people on the earth. Sometimes it's phenomenal. It's like a battlefield, it's like a war zone. Like you've got you know several hundred gannets, you've got thousands of mutton birds, you've got you know souries, going every which way, explosions all over the place. I mean, as far as you can see, it, some days it's like that. Go boys! 33 and a half. Well, I have been in New Zealand now for 40 years, last month, exactly. Initially, I didn't know what to expect, but it didn't take me long to fall in love with New Zealand and everything it has to offer. Um, starting with the people and going on to the fishing and the environment and the climate and I guess just the way of life. While I might not ever sound like a Kiwi, I think and act like one. This final season of mine is certainly going to be a bit of a mixture of emotions, I can tell you that. And I think they're already starting to kick in. I've got until the end of July to uh, wrap up my season and kind of say goodbye to Pursuit. It's been a great ride. Um, I've lived my dream and this boat's been a huge part of it. I'm thoroughly going to enjoy this last season to the absolute hill.